Welcome back to Live from the Camper. My name's Tony, and today we're making walking tacos. What's a walking taco, you ask? Well, it ain't a taco with legs walking around. That's just plain creepy. Nah, it's a taco. But instead of using taco shells, you're going to break open a little bag of Doritos or the Cool Ranch Doritos or Fritos and pour all your taco stuff right in there and eat it right out of the bag. Now, a lot of you campers already know about walking tacos, but there's a lot of y'all that don't. Great for kids, great for snack, great for any time. Well, are you ready? Good, let's get cooking. Now, the only thing you need for your walking tacos is a pound of meat. I'm using turkey meat. Trying to be a little healthier? Nah, it's just not as greasy. That's why I like using turkey meat. You're gonna use taco seasoning. I'm using Taco Bell. You're gonna get your favorite little bags of Doritos or whatever you wanna use some salsa, some sour cream, and some cheese. That's it, you're gonna make it just like a taco, but then dump it in a bag. Well, the first thing you wanna do is preheat your Ninja Foodie. So go ahead and hit the sear saute button and let it heat up for about five minutes, which I already did. So let's go ahead and add one tablespoon of olive oil because we are using turkey meat, so there's no grease in it because I'm using lean, which is also nice because at the end of it, when you're done cooking, you don't have to drain any grease. Eh? Eh? So let's go ahead and drop in that turkey meat. Get out your fancy meat grinder. And if you don't have one of these, I highly suggest getting one. They are fantastic for this. You don't have to sit there with your spatula. just It cuts it all up nice. I'll put a link down in the description box below where you can get yours on Amazon. I've been corrected. It's a meat masher. If I'm correct. <laughs> well, either it's a meat masher or a meat grinder. I don't know. I just know it chops up the meat and makes it easy. Now I'm gonna add just a little bit more olive oil because I forgot this is a pound and a quarter. And I want to brown the meat. Look how perfectly ground up that all is. Love this thing. Now that your meat's all cooked up, let's add one packet of taco seasoning. I'm using Taco Bell Mild because it's good. And instead of water, I'm using two thirds cup of beef broth. Great thing about that is it gives a, a beef flavor to your turkey without all that unhealthy stuff. And there it is, beef flavored turkey taco meat. Go ahead and turn your foodie off. Go ahead and pick the flavor you want. I want the Doritos nacho cheese flavor. Go ahead and crunch them up a little bit, but don't obliterate them. Now you're gonna open the bag. Yeah, crunch up a little bit more. You want kind of that consistency right there. I'll show all the cameras. Camera one, camera two. Camera one, camera two. Go ahead and take some of that taco meat, dump it right in the bag. Now if you want, you can add cheese to it at this point. It is nacho cheese flavor, so you don't have to, but I'm gonna. I'm using a little mild cheddar and Monterey Jack. Drop it in the bag. Now I don't know about you, I like a little sour cream on my tacos. So I'm going to drop a little of that in there, boom, and a little salsa. Going with the Pace Restaurant Style Medium, just because I like those commercials, remember? New York City, did a row. This year is made in Texas. And there you go. Can you see that in there? Looking good. Camera one, camera two. Now the most important part. How's it taste? I'm gonna tell you the bag's a little hot, so I'm gonna hold it from the top. Get a little Dorito, little meat. Now I can walk around and eat my taco. Mmm. 
it was fantastic. Well, I gave my wife the nacho cheese because, you know, that's her favorite. And I got to do what she says so or she'll hurt me. Yep. So I'm going with the chili cheese Fritos. So I'm going to do the same thing. I'm going to drop a little meat in there, a little sour cream, a little salsa. And the best part about it is the only thing to clean up is your foodie. You just throw this away when you're done. You use a plastic spoon, though. You can throw that away. Last dishes. It's like Frito pie for the soul. Mm. My soul's happy. So I got one question for you. Are you hungry? Mm -hmm. Good, let's eat.